Hi guys, welcome back. Back on Drift CE. And uh, man, I'll tell you today, we're gonna get into it quick because uh, what it is, is a bit of tuning and drifting today, man. And I didn't realize that um, I forgot, actually, I totally forgot that you could tune on this game. Game changer. So anyway, let's just walk over here. Cause uh, you know, let me speed this up a little bit. Here we go. So I know you guys like to see the engine builds, bro. So the inline six, bam already paid for this so boom we're gonna come back and rebuild this but i just want to just you know just start off the video by uh before i tune the um 180 sx man so basically i'm just gonna put a few parts on this before we get warmed up because uh man this is the first time coming on today so we've got to come on and hit this i mean this is where it's at man <laughs> Like I forgot about the tune inside of things, man. And um, when I was dyno in the cast, I forgot it was a, there's an option to tune. And I was like, oh, I forgot all about that. So uh, we'll put a few parts on here and then we'll jump in and we'll definitely come back and rebuild this engine. But I've got a little surprise for you guys. <laughs> all right. Cause uh, last night I thought, well, we could do a whole complete engine build. Um, but then I had that problem with, um, you know, getting the engine in the car, so I finally figured it out. So, uh, what we're gonna do, uh, yeah, we already got that. Uh, this engine's gonna be fully forged, so no playing, no playing whatsoever. Uh, should we stick on the head first? Actually, let's go underneath the car, see what we need. Just quickly wanna see what we wanna do underneath before. All right. What are we gonna do, come over here. Which one do we wanna do? Yeah, we're definitely gonna put on the most aggressive one, man. You know, we gotta have that that serious cam in there. You know, we do this, man. Right, let's just come a bit closer. I gotta can I slow this down? Yeah, oh yeah, I can slow it down. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, okay. All right. And this is what I like about this, man. Look at that. Just it's, it's a lot more steadier. There's a run and walk, and obviously, if you put it on run for some reason, it works smoother. So. You know, what can I say, man? Oh, no, 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 come back here, bro. We need you, we need you 100%. There you go. I mean, look at, I mean, just look how smooth that runs, man. And it's just so quick and easy to do, man. You know, you have a lot of fun on here doing this. Oh man, just check that out, man. So we're not gonna complete this whole build to, uh, today, the engine build, because the little surprise is, I might as well let you in on the secret. I've already built the engine and put it in the car, but I didn't want to just come on and, you know, to say, all right, let's just jump in and tune. So I just thought I'll put a few parts on. And then, I mean, just check that out, man. Damn, this is sick. We'll put on the oil pan. And then we'll come back and, uh, we'll come back and do this. Let's just put on the head first. Uh, all the pistons are in, yeah, mate. Yeah, that's how we do it around it. Uh, this is fully forged, by the way, so I want to see what it makes on the dyno. So we'll leave it here for now, because you know, man. I mean, just just look at the detail that goes into all of this, man. This is insane. Detail is so crazy. All right, so what we want to do? We're gonna go to. Oh, actually, let me just show you quickly. Let's walk over here just to show you. The inline six is fully built. And we're gonna go dyno it and then tune it because uh, I, I totally forgot that we could tune the cars in this game. And I mean, Drift CE is a sick game. I mean, if you don't have it, you need to get it, man. Seriously, you will absolutely love this game. Hold on a minute. No, we don't want to do that. We want to come over here. So we want to go to the dyno. All right, here we go. Straight to the dyno. Now I haven't. What I did was I surprised myself. So fully forged, um, stage three. So we're gonna see what it makes on the dyno. So here we go, man. Hopefully some big numbers. Let's hit it. Oh my goodness. This is over 1,000 horsepower. Bro, this, uh, this, oh my God, this 180 is going to be bad. Okay, right, so what do I wanna do now? I wanna come over here Um. here we go. Now, let me just go through the list a minute just to see what I don't have and what I do have. I mean, this is, Stage three, this has everything where you can tune everything, man. So, tire pressures, uh, I'll leave like this uh, 1.8 on the front and 1, 1.3 on the rear because this is, I'm actually actually new to the tuning because even on the PC, I didn't even do this. 
Okay, brakes. Uh, oh, look. Even the handbrake force. Man. Could I bring that down a touch? Let me bring down the handbrake force. for yeah. Let me bring it down a bit because it is quite sharp. And we need it. Yeah, I'm going to leave it on about... Um, let's leave it on about... Yeah, yeah we'll leave it on about 67%. Now, this is where it gets... I mean, look. Come on, man. Look at this. Oh, my days. Right, so I'm not going to mess with any of this just yet because I want to see how the car, uh, uh, you know, reacts on the track. Um, gears. Oh, look at this, man. This is this is next level, guys. Next level. Steering angle is at 65. Um, I wonder if... Actually, I'm not going to go full angle. I could do, but this car does pull mad angle, so we'll, we'll leave it there. And then we can always come back in and tweak this stuff. Whoops, I didn't want to touch none of that. Oops, I shouldn't have messed with that. All right, we'll leave that about there. So we're not going to mess around with any of this just yet because I can always come back in. Uh, front camber. Man, this is this is next level. Rear camber. I'm definitely going to change the rear camber because rear camber for me, that's that's where I need it. For some reason, that always has works for me. Suspension. Oh, my days. I knew the car had some, some monster truck ride height, so we're going to definitely bring this down. Definitely, all right. We're not gonna mess too much because I, I like my I like my fitment, and I think that should be about it. We'll save that, and then we will come out of the dyno, and then we'll hit. We're gonna go on track with this monster. I don't know if I'll be able to handle it, but uh, we'll, we'll give it a try. Uh, I wonder if I want to do it. Actually, we're, we're gonna go. We're, we're gonna do it on free roam. I mean, I don't really want to mess around. So we'll do free run when we hit this track. And tomorrow I'll come back on. We can dive into the tuning some more. And then I'll finish building that engine. Because that's very therapeutic for me. So. Oh. Hey, good. Then pop some banks. Stage three. Oh, my days. All right, man. All right. Oh, I think this is going to be a handful. Oh, yeah. She's going to be a handful and a half. All right. We're going to give it a test, right? So this is a. Uh, Oh, hold on, let me just check something out. I think the <laughs> Wait, look at this. Ooh, she's slammed. She's that slammed. I'm gonna have to change those wheel spaces on the rear. Um, I think I've got 100 mil on the rear, so I'm gonna go down to about maybe 50. But other than that, man, look how slammed it looks, bruv. All right, <laughs> with no further ado, let's go test this, see what we're working with. In and six, baby. Ooh. All right, man, this is the first test, so. Oh, the more you dive into this game, man. It, someone said to me in the, my comment section that it's the best drifting game actually on console, and I will have to agree with that. Uh, Forza Motorsport always been good, but the, the wheel physics, like, they, obviously they're going to change it, I know that much for a fact, but this this is like how a set of Corsa, you know, how it even react on the wheel, you know, the counter steer, man. It does it so good. And this is fair game, man. We didn't even touch that foot. I ain't messing with none of the gears. Are we getting flames? Alright, drop it in the fourth. Oh, that fourth is monstrous. Okay, okay. Send it. What can I say, man? The more horsepower, more wheel speed. This thing, oh, we are gonna definitely dive into uh, some of the tasks you have to do for the drifting, man, because that's how you make the money. Oh, this is so sick. And I adjust the handbrake, but we didn't get no points for that. That's all good. I'm not really too concerned about the points. But uh, definitely, man, I'm going to be diving into, uh, you know, the ride height. Because as you can see, it's going through the fenders a bit. And that. That's, I'm, I'm kind of like, I've got OCD like that, man. I like my fitment to be proper. Like, damn, and you can mess with the camber. I, man, I had no idea, ladies and gentlemen. So, wow. I haven't played this game for so long. I just thought you put the part. I mean, the car drifts straight off the bat from when you... Uh, when you build it, but to dive into the tuning, differential settings, gears, car, uh, steering angle, the works, man. This is where it's at. And this car, we didn't, listen, we're in the third game, and we can touch that fourth. We are definitely, I'll tell you what we're going to do tomorrow. We're going to dive into some of the drift zones on here, man. Right, and see if we can get all the clipping points. Man, this is sick. Can you hear that backfire, my guys? Damn. And ladies, here we go. 
Oh, that fool gets the money. I put some career key boys on the rear, so they're staggered. 17's at the front, 18's at the rear. I mean, what game can you do that on? Tell me. I don't, I don't know. Maybe, alright, we'll give it to Car X, because Car X, you can do some mad fitment. I mean, just think, this is a proper drifting game, man. Oh, my days, man. We're going to have to do a little cockpit, man. We are going to have to do a little cockpit, man. Look at that angle, man. Ooh, a back heat. Can we pull a back heat? Ooh. Almost, almost. That was sick. My goodness. And then, um, like I said, I've been working on my paint job. It's, it's not quite finished yet. So it's a work in progress. And that's another thing on here, man. You know, not just the tune inside of stuff. Oh, wall tap. Lovely. I'll take that. It's not just the tune inside of things. It's liveries. I mean, I just can't wait for the new updates that will come to this game. The handbrake feels so much better. It was so sharp. I'm glad I pulled that down a bit. Oh mate, my drifting feels so much better today. Let's get, look at that, look at that. Come on, let's get it, let's get it right on the edge there. Come on, look at that. I tell you man, these tracks. These tracks are sick. I don't know what to say man, I mean, I'm so glad they brought it to console because it, you know, it really broadens the audience for, for these type of games. Because like, when they come out on PC, it's like only selected few, like the elitist on the PC can get these games. And I'm so glad that they bought this uh, console. Uh, what can I tell you? Right, we're going to do this last point. I'm going to jump on some top and see what's going on. See what's got down. Alright, let me just pull over a minute. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Just one more look at the car. The car looks absolutely vicious, man. I mean, I, you don't have to spray it. You can leave it mixed match. You can do whatever you want, man. And I actually like it, man. I have to put a big wang on the back, man. Come on. Come on. Rocket Bunny, big wang. And next level. Right. Let's jump into the cockpit and do a little cockpit drifting. Let's see what's going down. Ooh, we, the views. I love the views, man. All right. We'll leave it here because I don't want to mess with the cockpit too much. I'm going to drop it in a fourth. Spin out. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, hold on. This is the, this is the, uh, the cockpit that don't move. Right, one second. That looks good. I think the handbrake works too, yeah. And he pulls the handbrake, but the only thing is I'm not sure about the wheel. The wheel looks like it's moving really weird there, but we're going to change it to the other view in a sec. Yeah, this is, I think this is maybe for controller, because that only goes to like 270 degrees of rotation in the whip. So, hold on, right, let's just change. Let's just change it one more time. Yeah, this is more like it. Right now we've got some real head motion. This is how we're gonna roll. Let's go for it. You see, you see what I'm saying about the real head motion? Mm -hmm. that handbrake. Come on. Touch kick. It is in line six. Over a thousand horsepower. Look, I tell you, man, this is where it's at, man. And we're yet to like dive on to the online and use some of the drift uh, ready cars that's going to be another sick thing man get the boys on and uh yeah man we can get some tandems going on and for you wheel users out there you're going to be so impressed the force feedback is amazing the game is amazing i just can't wait to see what updates they come out with man uh, new cars and because there's if you look in the list when you're looking at it there's lots of blank spaces so you know <laughs> I remember when this game first came out on PC. I was like, was it? It was uh, Drift 19, and then it went to Drift 21, and then now we're Drift CE. Um, yeah, C C E. And man, I'm just trying to concentrate on this drifting right, man. That angle's mad, bro. This real head motion is perfect, man. Real perfect. My goodness. Let's go. Handbrake. Yeah, man. Bringing down that handbrake force was so good, man. Because literally it was sharp, we would pull it and it would just snap the car, just snap straight. There we go, can we get close to the wall? Oh yes mate, send it. Over a thousand horsepower, fully forged, 180SX. Come on, don't you lose that. Is a beast. And the pops and bangs man, turbo sounds, woo -hoo. Oh it sounds so cool. tune inside of things man is I forgot all about the tuning I was thinking damn I don't know why I was thinking you couldn't tune on this game but um my goodness keep that clutch baby all right we're gonna do 
one more in the third person before we end out today's video. Hey, mate, that's amazing. Amazing. Wow. I wonder if we can... Does it work with this? Blue head mantra? It should really work in all of the cockpit views, but I mean, I ain't complaining. Here we go, man. I right, send it. Last lap. Yeah, the tuning side of things, I'm so impressed with, man. Hey, listen, um, let me know in the comment section if you'd uh, like me to stay on this game for the rest of my life. Because <laughs> I would. I mean, I've got to play my um, set of course, I've got to play that, I've got to do it. But also, I've got ACC. Uh, let me know what game you'd like to see next after this part. We're going to be doing a few more days on this game. Oh, backwards entry. Come on. Oh, almost, almost. All right, all right. That was so good. Just listen to them pox and bangs, man. All right, let me see if I can get a little dugget going on. Oh, that is so sick. A little figure of eight. This is so sick. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more content. And peeps, have a great weekend. Peace.